Alright team, so we're back with the video that I said I would do a few months ago if there's any sort of follow-up, and it involves the whole Takahiro Sakurai situation. It was, of course, the Japanese voice actor, the guy that's been voicing Cloud the entire time that Cloud's had a voice, who a few months ago it came out that he was cheating on his wife, right? He was married for like 20 or so years, and for like half of that or more, he was cheating on his wife with a co-worker, somebody that was like a writer for a radio program. But it was deeper than that, too. Like, people didn't know that he was married. Like, even, like, his employer, his agency didn't know he was married. The woman who was cheating on his wife with didn't know that he was married. And she actually thought they were going to get married at one point. So when the information came out, she had, like, a, a panic attack or something. Had to go to the hospital. It was, like, a whole situation, right? It's kind of the TLDR on that. And actually, it turns out there's more than one update to this story. Because I was just seeing the headlines of what we were supposed to talk about today. But looking into, like, the Silicon Era article, there's actually an update to the previous story. In that Sakurai did not just cheat on his wife with one woman. It was, it was multiple women, at least two as of right now. So the original story was Akko, Eiko, however you say her name, that was like the writer for his radio program. But then there's also another woman. And it's actually believed by people that he potentially has had multiple partners because like there's rumors and stuff that he's like been hooking up with like other voice actors and stuff like that over the years. So the revelation that he actually was cheating on somebody else as well, there's at least a third person involved in all of this. This article came out from Yahoo on January 22nd. I can't get Google Translate to translate the website for some reason. It just like defaults back to like the Yahoo Japanese like homepage. It's not like the biggest deal because like Google Translate's obviously not the best quality usually, but it's there's stuff that's in that Japanese article that Silicon Air is not reporting in their article because that's how I learned that there's potentially other partners involved. So I'm having to like go like paragraph by paragraph and just use Google Translate itself to translate the text, and that's how I also learned that there's potential of this going to the court, right? Like it's not just this guy's cheating that's bad; he might lose some roles or something. Like there might be some legal action involved, which is kind of crazy. And it's actually an interesting thing to talk about that we didn't discuss with that previous video I did on this topic is. It being illegal, right? That's something that some people were trying to have the argument in the comments of that video about, you know, separating the art from the artist, all that other stuff. But it's like, this is actually a crime, right? Like, adultery is illegal in, I think, every state in America. If I'm not mistaken, there could be some that aren't. But it's also illegal in Japan, as far as I can tell, from kind of looking it up. So it's more than just this guy did a bad thing. Maybe we can ignore it or leave it alone or whatever. He's literally breaking the law, right? We wouldn't brush it aside if it was Sakurai doing, like, a robbery or a murder. I know those are extreme examples, but I'm just pointing out, like, it's the law being broken. It's a crime, right? So I think it's fine for us to talk about it. So I think it's perfectly fine for people to form opinions on Sakurai because of this, and I don't think we get to just brush it aside because it's just cheating. And so when it comes to that previous video I did on this matter, I had some negative things to say about Sakurai, right? Because I do think it takes a bad person to do this. I think cheating's a pretty avoidable act, right? But it takes a particularly evil person to do it this much and this long, right? He's done it with multiple women, and cheated on his wife for at least half of their marriage with, like, Akko, Eiko. I'm still not entirely sure how to pronounce the name, but you can take the things that I said in that previous video, and you can now double them, or triple them, or whatever the case, because now we know there's more than just one woman he's cheated on his wife with. Potentially untold numbers, depending on how long he's been doing this. Right? He's been cheating on his wife for, like, 10-plus years, and he's been doing that with maybe with other voice actors and staff and stuff uh, this whole entire time. Like, who knows how many women, right? Now, the other update to this entire debacle, I suppose we'll call it, that I initially thought was the premise of the entire video, until I learned there was other things to talk about, is that we're already seeing Sakurai lose some roles, which is kind of what we talked about with that previous video, it was kind of the whole crux of that video, was with this whole drama, if you want to call it that, of him like cheating his wife, this whole like, it being all public and shit, and all the bad stuff around it, is whether or not he's going to lose some roles, but specifically as it pertains to us here, is would they fire him from the role of Cloud Strife? So right here we just have a piece of the Silicon Air article, and it says, due to various reasons, the studio behind Ayaka recast Takahiro Sakurai as Haruwaki Kurama, probably butchering that, while the Ayaka Twitter account did not state the exact reason, it likely has to do with the multiple adultery allegations against Sakurai in an update from our original story. News came out that Sakurai was cheating on a total of three women for over a decade. So a couple things to maybe talk about there. For one, they mentioned that Sakurai was cheating on three women for over a decade. So maybe that third woman that we previously talked about has been in the picture for quite a long time. Because I can't get like a time frame on how long she's been around or whatever. But maybe she's also been there for like 10 plus years at this point. And the other obvious thing here is that we're now seeing Sakurai lose roles probably because of the adultery thing, even if they don't want to be direct about it. And it's proof that he's not untouchable, because if you go back to like the previous video, there's actually people in my comments I could pull up a quote, I could put it on screen if I wanted to, of somebody saying that Sakurai is too big to be replaced. And this is proof that that's not the case. Now, Ayaka is obviously an upcoming anime. It's not something that's been out for years and years and years that he's been voicing characters for or anything. But this shows that there are studios out there that do not want to continue working with him because of the recent stuff that's happened with Sakurai. And maybe there's going to be other studios in the future that follow suit. And here we have the actual official statement. I figured we should read this as well. It says, We would like to inform you that Takahiro Sakurai, who was scheduled to appear as Haruaki Kurama in the completely new original animation, Ayaka, will start an animation project in 2023, will be changed due to various circumstances. We sincerely apologize for causing trouble and concern to everyone who is looking forward to this work and to everyone involved. In addition, we will announce the new casting again. Thank you for your understanding and for your support in the future development of this work. 
So it's been a few months since that initial story broke, and we're now finally seeing it catch up to Sakurai. He's losing at least one role so far. There could be more in the future. And I want to be perfectly honest here, right? While I think he's a bad dude, and I disagree with everything that he's done, I'm not over here trying to petition for Sakurai to lose his livelihood, right? Because that's a fucked up situation, right? I'm not saying that every studio needs to drop him, but I'm also not going to fault any like companies that want to part ways with him because of what he's done, right? Like, if they wanted to fire him from, like, Mob Psycho or Demon Slayer or whatever other animes and stuff that he does, I'm not going to fault any studio, right? And the whole topic of discussion here for us, anyways is whether or not he would continue to voice Cloud Strife in the future, right? And that's the thing. If Square Enix were to continue using him, I'm not going to, like, petition for them to fire Sakurai. But also, if they wanted to fire the guy and replace him with somebody else to voice Cloud Strife, I'd be in support of that as well. That's going to be more or less the video, my dude. So, a few months ago, when we did that initial video, I said I would do a follow-up, and that's what we're doing here. But I'm not going to keep doing videos every time, like, Sakurai loses a role, unless it pertains to the character of Cloud Strife. You know, FF7, Square Enix, whatever the case. Like, if he ends up getting fired from that role or something, or they let him go, replace him, whatever... We'll definitely do some sort of follow-up video, but this will be the last Sakurai-related video we do until that maybe happens. So next, of course, pass off to you guys. It's been a few months since the actual initial story broke. The updates to this are that there's for sure a third woman involved, right? He's cheating on his wife with two separate women, but technically cheating on all of them, obviously. And that now we're seeing him lose a role. It's only one so far, but it's proof that Sakurai is not this god-tier level voice actor that's just completely untouchable. Like, he's now lost one of his roles. Maybe there'll be more to follow. What are your thoughts? But mainly when it comes to, like, the cheating thing, because the fact that we now learn that there's more people involved, man, like, if you're somebody that kind of brushed off previously, are you still just trying to ignore it? Like, it's not a big deal. We shouldn't uh, separate art from the artist, all that other shit. Anyways, that's the video, my dude. Subscribe to you guys our new social networks in the description below. Follow me on Twitter, dash YT. That's it. Bye. I used to care what people thought, but now I care more. And nobody out here's got it figured out. So therefore, I've lost all hope of a happy ending. Depending on whether or not it's worth it. So insecure, no one's perfect. We spend it with no shame. We blow that. Like old train, we in here. Like low game or leave it. Like old bang.